Hey guys, it's Jane. Top 5 Wednesday this week is Top 5 Series Titles. So let's get into it. Number 1 is a series that begins with the beautiful and haunting The Shadow of the Wind. This is a loose series comprising of three novels and a short story. And its title in English is The Cemetery of Forgotten Books. Number 2 is a series I'm still in the process of reading. It's Margaret Atwood's sci-fi series beginning with Oryx and Crake. This series uh, takes the unusual step of naming itself after its third book. This is the Madadam trilogy and um, I had to choose that. You can't not choose a palindromic name. Oh, plus this actually spawned its own video game. So how about that? For our third series, we travel to Botswana and a series that is titled much more usually after its first book. This is the number one ladies detective agency. Number four may or may not have its own video game, but according to the internet, it has spawned a whole host of tattoos. This is Philip Pullman's beautifully written children's fantasy series, evocatively yet disturbingly titled his Dark Materials. And number five is a series written by probably the only author ever to teach Michael Caine to break an egg. It is Len Dayton's fantastic Cold War spy thriller trilogy, Hook, Line and Sinker. Uh, this is actually a trilogy which finds its place within a trilogy of trilogies all about Bernard Samson, but um, yeah, I could only pick one of them. What kind of sinker it is? That's me. That's Top 5 Wednesday. Hope you're all well. Talk to you later. Bye.